Hi, Ophicus. How are you? Hope you're well out there. Welcome to Ophicus and me, guys. I appreciate you for stopping by here with me today. It is Thursday, February 15th. 2024 it's 11 31 p.m right now where i am appreciate you guys for stopping by here with me today to catch a vibe hope you guys are well hope you had a good day today and i appreciate every single last one of you guys thank you so very much for all that you do and have work done to helping this channel grow in advance. Thank you. And uh, if you're new, I do Oracle. I do index. I do three decks of Carol, and this is the Priestess of White Oracle. So let's see what we get. Hope you guys like. Hope you stay over and enjoy the reading. One more time. Calming the waters with number 32 at the bottom here. Power over difficulty. Reclaiming your power. And there's nothing too difficult for you, you know. So 32 equals a 5. And then you have here number 3. Calming the waters. Peaceful. Self-regulation. Keeping self-balance. So here we have 3. Calming the waters. The High Priestess of Light brings her deeper powers of healing energy to the earth and to your life. The elk enters she wears on her golden crown act as antenna. They receive guidance and power from universal light, which she then channels into the earth and waters below. Her peaceful intentions are of balance and alignment. As she brings peace to the planet, she also calls you to calm the waters within your own life. It's time. It's time for you to take an honest look at your daily energy. Are things too hectic? For you to maintain a calm approach to your task, you may feel you have no control, but you can and must regulate the pace of your everyday activities, always devoting some time to your own peaceful priorities. The waters of life run deep. And there are often deeper personal lessons than you may be aware of. Do you have the ability to be self-directed, set boundaries, create balance, and stay calm and spirit-connected even in the middle of personal or professional storms in the face of unending? And sometimes frantic demands of life, this card is telling you to stop and trust in the unwavering truth of your soul's universal connection. Your peaceful yet profound faith will calm the swirling waters and bring the blessed resolutions you desire. Yeah, just stay calm, guys. Find your center, breathe in, breathe out. <laughs> Maybe number three is your number. Here we go. Let's get started and see what we get. Yeah. Self regulation. Staying calm. Trusting in oneself. Trusting in God. Just say, you know what? Let me just relax here.
Okay, one more time. Don't be mad. You're upset. Praying for it. Maybe met at a football game. Name starts with the letter V. Celebrate good times. Come on, let's celebrate. We had the heart yesterday. <laughs> let's celebrate life, guys. Yeah, I know sometimes it's like, uh, as soon as I said that, this car was right. You too blessed to be stressed, okay? Like, I don't know. I ain't come this damn far, right? Be letting this stuff take me. <laughs> me give it all. I can't stop shape. Stay calm. <laughs> All right, here we go. One more time. Here they come. One more. You took your energy all the way back. Moment. 
very passionate about everything. go finally <laughs> we have here infatuated all i want to do is have some fun i got feeling another one my show crow you're a bodyguard or a security guard one day at a time it's all we can do part of staying calm and understanding that you drive a Mustang. Lesson learned. Just breathe. Just the two of us. We can make it if we try. Just the two of us. That's Bill Withers. And you played your position in it. Okay. You drive a BMW or a Mercedes Benz. You're in control over this. They are very considerate. They don't love me like you do. Reunited and it feels so good. Okay. <laughs> Single life ain't too bad. You have the special ingredient, Paris, France. The war is won before the battle begins. You don't know what you've done to me. <laughs> You're very ma magnetic and ma magnificent. The haters ignore them. You're in denial about how you feel. Don't be afraid of the unknown. You drive a Jeep. Sky's the limit. Don't worry. Trust in God and go with the foot. Always. This is what you call love. It's okay to cry. And from friends to lovers. Very independent. <laughs> we have breathe iron again. Inhale, exhale, breathe. They come with the extras all the time. You get your hustle on every day. Cheesecake and strawberry topping. The mask is on. Spa day all day. I feel ashamed of my behavior. Something is hidden. Play it safe. Be really down to earth. You have many credentials. Very spontaneous. And too blessed to be stressed. Overqualified. A new adventure awaits you. Healing is required. Someone's name starts with the letter L. You have a special gift. Use it. You could be a police officer. You live in the suburbs. Are you worried about what other people think or say? Why? Why? Rewriting the story. Pescatarian. You could be... Waking up at 333 a lot or seeing the number 333. It's time to decide. Volunteer some time. Animal lover. Congratulations. Family is everything. Infinity and beyond. One door is about to close for another to open. From suppressed to opulent. Notified by email. 
a major breakthrough. Okay. Twin flame energy. Spa day again. Yeah, spa day all day. Just take the day to yourself. Not getting enough rest. I know I need to go to sleep. <laughs> Winter time right now. They will never get it. The end. Period. Let me go get the doors back. I'll be right back. <sighs> Oh, my I used the birth back yesterday, too, right? I think so. Okay, so, yeah. Calming the water, self-regulation, and... Oh, peaceful self-regulation. Why are we keeping that on book out? Let me see one more time. Hmm... All right, taking a look at your your schedule in a sense, and uh, are things just all over the place? You know, trying to get everything in order and to a relaxed space. Yeah, balanced and calm and spin. Spirit connected. Yeah, staying calm. And then here with the the bottom, you know, it says power over difficulty. So you have the power to even, you know, overcome all of the chaos or hecticness that's going on in your world, you know. It says reclaiming your power, you know. Realizing that you, you are the one that holds, you know, the power. You, you're the one that will be able to get all this in control. So, I'm trying to figure out which deck I want to use. Um, staying calm. Um, making space for. I keep looking at this deck. All right, well, I guess I'll figure out the last one. Can I get there? <laughs> Appreciate you guys for being patient with me. Here we go. Let's see what we can. One more time. Okay. You gotta, you have to love yourself. You have to, you know, get rest. It says you're not getting enough rest. Right, right here. Okay. Love yourself. They say, you know what? What is important, what's not, you know, prioritize some things, you know, get things back in balance here with the Five of Cups first card out, okay, it says disappointment. So, um, in terms of you staying calm and things that are going on in your life, Maybe you went through a breakup, you know, and you're trying your best to regulate your emotions.
with the five of this and then to the nine of wands talks about determination it says here it says here resilience yeah so it's like even though you had a breakup and felt left out you're balance you're rebalancing your life you know you're one day at a time you know maybe you were in love or something but you kept it moving focus on yourself love's gonna come back around okay but you you didn't let that energy of disappointment and uh, lack with this here king of pentacles that you were involved with okay it's a very magnetic individual Okay, I say that because it fell right on top of that. And Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. Yeah, like, and it says here, King of um, Pentacle. Maybe they were like a real shot caller, you know. Maybe they had a lot of powers. So that's why I said reclaiming your power, you know, balancing everything out in your life so you can have your own power or something like that. You know, like maybe you were attached to this person here, like maybe in the wrong ways. Maybe it's best that you did maybe you know what I mean like not like that but you know maybe it's best that you are like kind of on a on a different path now you know maybe you can focus again or something don't be afraid of the unknown you know maybe you were with this person for a while I don't know we well, only says three of this but I don't know so here with the um eight of this like I said, maybe you weren't working or something like that when you were with this person. So now it's like you, you, all this, I don't know, all this stuff just came up out of nowhere because the eight of this can reverse with the devil card right next to it. Fall on top of don't be afraid of the unknown. And a single life ain't that bad one day at a time. You live in the suburbs, um, that'd be crazy. I mean, not really, but that I pick that up like that. That's like, I don't normally think of stuff like that. So here with the sun and seven of this. Underneath the nine of wands, it's, it's like really like, you know that, I guess you got to get yourself in order and do certain things so things will be right for you with the seven of this, like investing your time. And your energy and you know different things and with the sun it just said like right here sky's the limit you you see how bright like your own world can be or i don't know you see something and then here with the hangman With the Knight of Swords. So whatever it is that you are doing, uh, even though it may be like burdensome, uh, all that you're doing, you know, um, or tiring or something of that nature. Maybe more so tiring, like you're just tired, you haven't had any sleep. Um, 
but with the Knight of Swords, maybe you just wanted to tell everybody, like, I don't know, like, what they mean to you or something like that, I don't know what you want to say, Man, maybe you want to say something to this here individual that you walked away from, or y'all just broke up, or... Like, or maybe, you know, like, you thought that you wouldn't make it with the moon. And you didn't think that you would make it on your own or something like that because you've been living with him for a while. Or, you know, he had everything in control. He had the power. And if the hangman, maybe that, that was your difficult position with this person. Like, they were that type. Like just mm -hmm. Hmm. so you had to regain your power and walk away. I mean, the world around you with the person was getting just a little bit chaotic, you know, or something like that. Maybe that's where all of it started. Maybe even you have to realize, like, my my life was calm or, or it can be if I wasn't attached to this person. Maybe that's it. So with the moon, the moon and the sun, the moon is falling on top of the sun. Maybe it's just talking about like how you're like in just you know divine like feminine energy too you know um tapping into yourself staying calm and you know just trying to stay relaxed. Mm. Okay, took me a minute. <laughs> Wow, Ten of Pentacles. Excuse me, you want you want to have great wealth. Um, ten of Swords, maybe you're just like oh, like I said, maybe this person had a lot of money. Maybe you were thinking about marrying them or something like that. Yeah, but you got the energy to walk away and to prove a point, not only to yourself, but to this person, too. Yeah, change on the way to Pentacles. Appreciate you guys for being here with me today. Come back and rock with me anytime here on a few things in me where I do your daily reads. I appreciate you guys. So very much if you're still here with me right now. <laughs> Thank you guys. Love you guys. I appreciate you guys so very much for all of the love and support. Like, share, comment, and subscribe, please. And thank you. And of course, only if you like. I appreciate it all. Here's the second deck. So, yeah, basically, like what I'm getting is that you were in a relationship where this person. You know, uh, always brought it to the attention that, you know, you wouldn't have anything if you weren't with him or something like that. And maybe you thought that, you know, you would, uh, you know, be like, uh, I guess maybe... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, not established, but 
comfortable in a sense, you know, uh, being with this person and the lifestyle that you could have lived or something like that. But um, there was a breakup or you just really woke up and walked away from this person because after a while it was a little bit um, just too much to deal with. I don't know if he was always like that or if it just got worse. I mean, if he, if he was like that and it got worse over time or, you know, he just came out of nowhere acting like this. I don't know. One more time. <clears throat> but however the case, you realize that you didn't need that in your life, that energy being attached to someone like that. Like, that just, yeah, like with the Eight of Pentacles, you may not have been working, this person may have been taking care of you or something like that. You know, holding it down. Yeah, maybe they got you, you know, maybe they were just cool with their money. Maybe then they started, like, acting funny. Mm-hmm. Hold on one second. Nine of Wands, two times over the card right here. So, yes, definitely. You, uh, you said, you know what? Okay, that's cool. I'm gonna go this way. So you think I can't make it on my own, you know? Maybe you're not like, you know, like that, like just wanting to live off of someone, but maybe they just caught you at a time when you were, you know, struggling or you didn't have a job or something like that. So very well possible. Here we have the Wheel of Fortune. So things start to go in your favor once you start to do something about it. Um... Seven of Cups, <laughs> realizing you don't have to be with this person, you're not stuck with this person. Wow, yeah, with the Knight of Swords, Knight of Swords again, which is right here. So it's like, yeah, you can't wait to go tell this dude, like, I'm in control of my life, you know, Queen of Cups. I knew I had to get up and do something, I didn't want to continue to live like this. You know, I don't know, Ten of Cups talks about an abundant, an abundant amount of love. And maybe you're like, yeah, I want a, a family one day and I knew I couldn't have that with you. So I had to get out there and go do me and grind, make a name for myself. Maybe go back to school, page of swords, and learn some things. But you're definitely trying to balance out a lot of stuff, you know. So, it's like, yeah, you know. Maybe, like I said, you know, breaking up with somebody. And trying your best to just stay calm throughout everything that you have going on. You know, you just picked up a lot of extra weight when you had to go out into the world and do it yourself. You know, whether again or whatever, however, you know. Uh, yeah, that's interesting. Um, like I said, it's interesting that I picked that up and at the bottom page of Pentacles. Oh, goodness. Charger. Okay. Now, uh, one more day. Um, yeah, I'll take the journey, Tarot. 
Let's see what we're going on here. Over ten. With the two of swords. The two of swords talks about like being blindfolded, not seeing something coming, having to make a, a quick decision, you know. With the Knight of Pentacle, first car. And then the Ace of Cups, now in reverse. That was our first card at the bottom when we first started, and then death in reverse. It seems like, you know, that you, you know, like yesterday. This is like a... Interesting vibe I'm picking up on for the past three days. So you're really trying to be as chill as you can be and calm as you can be with this Knight of Pentacles, just taking things easy. The Ace of Cups is like, you know that yeah, you have all the love. You know, you're focused on yourself, trying to, you know, just stay balanced and get yourself on the right track and to be independent. Maybe you're too blessed to be stressed. You're not worried about it. Major breakthroughs, you know. You had breathe out here two, two times. You know, yeah. So... You know, there wasn't that much love coming from this person. They were just like, you know, financially um, mature set. You know, they had it. So, however the case, you have here death in reverse also. And um, you're like... Uh, not a, this is not going to take me out, you know. Like <laughs> that's not happening. The war is won before the battle begins. So you're like, wow! I see how beautiful, you know, life is or can really be, or something like that. I don't know if it's like a new experience, like you never gotten out there. Maybe hustle for yourself. I'm not too sure. Could be have you know? It could have been uh, catered to most of your adult life, or you know, not really have to have a job. That's very possible. Yeah, but you know, maybe you might uh, try this out. I don't know. Maybe you were in a space and you got with somebody, and you're like, you know, you just need to take a break or something. I don't know. Eight of Pentacles. Yeah. Just working on yourself here. I never got the eight, okay. Thought I did. With the Eight of Swords. He used to sit up and think about, you know, <clears throat> leaving or, you know, what, just the way things would be in the future. The two of swords, you didn't see it happening like this. 
the King of Pentacles again. Yeah. Now the Nine of Pentacles. Single life ain't too bad. You know. Interesting. Hmm. Well, there we have it. Love you guys. Take care. See you. Bye-bye.